Hi, this is Tim. Welcome to Open Mic Week 2. This week we're going to ask you to respond to our prompts on Google Docs and then come back later in the week and leave voice comments for one or more responses uh, that you see on the document. So I'm just going to show you quickly how to set up your Google Docs so that you can leave voice comments. Once you're in your Google Docs page, go to the red Create button and click on it. And at the bottom, you'll see Connect More Apps. Click on that blue link. Then in the search box up here, you're going to type in the name of the voice comment app, which is called Kaizena, K-A-I-Z-E-N-A. -E and once you get this page, you'll have a blue button here that says Connect, if you haven't already connected it to your Google Docs. Once you click on the connect button, then it will connect it and you can close this. Next, you're going to go to kaizena.com and you'll have a place down here where it says connect to Google Drive. Click on the green button. It will ask you to accept their terms. And then you'll see a picture of your Google Drive page. I'm going to open up this document, Open Mic to Responses. Click on it and then hit Select. And here you'll see the document that we will be sharing with you. Uh, there'll be a place where we'll have a prompt uh, discussion guide here and then a place for each person to leave a response. And as I said earlier, later in the week we want you to come back and open up this page on the Kaizena page and leave a response, a, a voice response for somebody. So to leave a voice response, all you need to do, let me get rid of this one, that was my practice, uh, all you need to do is Highlight some text. I'm going to highlight this text. And remember, we're doing this on the kaizena.com page. And then click on the microphone here. The first time that you do this, you'll get a warning box uh, asking for permission for you to use the microphone on your computer. So you need to accept that and allow it, and it's a good idea to click the box that says remember so you won't have to do that every time. Then when you're ready you just hit record. This link goes to another tutorial that I found on YouTube which goes further into how you can use Kaizena with students. Click stop when you're done. If you want to listen to it, see how it came out, you can do that. This link goes to another and I think that's enough and then you hit done. And that's how you leave a voice comment. So feel free to email any of your friendly Open Mic 2 sponsors. That would be Gail, Roberta, Joe, or Tim, if you have any questions. And have fun. Thanks.